iPhone is not that phone for you, in my own opinion. Mm. iPhone is going to disappoint you. They will serve you breakfast. <laughs> iPhone 14 Pro Max and Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra, the luxury phones edition. I don't want to feel no more. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are going to be comparing and contrasting between iPhones and Samsung. So if you know this is a content you would love to watch, just make sure to keep on watching. I have used an iPhone before, not my personal phone, but and also I have friends that use iPhones and Samsung. So I should be in the best position to differentiate between both of them. There are some people that would never prefer an iPhone to a Samsung phone. And there are some people that no matter what you tell them, they will forever prefer a Samsung phone to an iPhone phone and vice versa. It all boils down to preference. Some people just naturally love iPhones, while some people just naturally love Samsung phones. They are both big brands in the phone industry, if not the biggest phone brands. Both phones are unique in their own way, and you buying them depends on the kind of service you want the phone to render for you. Firstly, some people believe that iPhone puts you under pressure because every year a new one comes up and you would want to level up you want to upgrade for example i'm using an iphone 11 you see iphone 11 pro max would come out very soon iphone 12 will come out some very soon iphone 13 will come out and some people believe that iphone puts them under pressure and that's the reason they don't want to get an iphone because when a new one comes out you start feeling oh my own is outdated oh i need to level up i need to step up that's what some people believe about iphone do you think it's true leave it in the comments second the value yes some people think iphone retain its value more than a samsung phone an iphone you can easily sell it out when a new one comes up and you want to level up unlike a samsung phone anyways guys do you think it's true leave it in the comments now let's go to the camera for me personally i don't believe any phone has been able to beat iphone photo and video quality but some people believe that samsung upped his game when it produced the s23 series guys what do you think i believe that it all boils down to preference if you need a phone that will give you a natural video and photo view then i think you should go for an iphone but if you want camera quality that would give you more like a colored edited kind of video or photo then i think you should go for a samsung so it's all about preference but for me personally i don't believe that any phone has been able to beat iphone when it comes to photo and image quality what do you think guys leave it in the comments i believe iphone camera and video photo quality is top notch yeah it all goes down to preference if you need a neutral and natural kind of image and video then i think iphone should should be the best option for you and guys if you are watching to this point and this is your first time on my channel please don't forget to subscribe give this video a thumbs up it's totally free and help me share the video so a lot of people get to see it next battery capacity guys if you need a phone that would have a long lasting battery life then iphone is not that phone for you in my own opinion all the iphones i have used i have heard of i have had friends have their battery iphone really need to up their game when it comes to long lasting battery or battery capacity so for battery i think i would go for a samsung yeah because if it's for long lasting battery capacity <laughs> iPhone is going to disappoint you. They will serve you breakfast. <laughs> now, let's talk about maintenance. Yes, 
some people believe that a Samsung phone is more difficult to maintain because its parts are expensive like the screen and all those stuff but I also believe that for iPhone the internal features are more expensive to maintain because you basically have to pay for everything you use in an iPhone like Google App Store music and all those stuff anyways guys let's know what you think in the comments but for me I think for external features Samsung is quite expensive and difficult to maintain but for iPhone the internal features are relatively more expensive anyways guys let's know what you think in the comments well when it comes to samsung and iphone which is right for you personally i am a samsung babe i love a samsung phone but because of my content creation career i need a phone with a natural and neutral image and video quality that's why i will need to opt for an iphone anyways guys let me know your preference in the comment section because when it comes to iphones and samsung let's leave the price there are some samsung phones that are very very pricey it all goes down to preference leave your thoughts and your preference in the comment section and also why you prefer an iphone or why you prefer a samsung phone guys thank you so much for watching this amazing video and of course i'll see you all in another this or that edition and i'll be signing out for now guys bye